everybody, Colin here with another video. So today I have a package that came in the mail. Um, I ordered a classical puppets petticoat from Cloba, which is a shopping service. And I got the bell shaped petticoat. So here it is. It's in this tiny package, which concerns me. Because, you know, when you get a petticoat, you don't want it to look this small. So I'm hoping they just did a really good job at stuffing it into this bag. And that it'll poof out when I take it out. So I ordered from Cloba, so I'll do a review on Cloba first. So Cloba is a shopping service and for Taobao brands. And I, I've been needing a new petticoat for a while, so I decided to order through them to get a classical puppets petticoat. I got a black one and the communication was really, really good. I got responses at least within 24 hours at each time I asked a question. Um, they were very friendly, very helpful, um, told me about everything as it was going on, kept me up to date on everything. The last email I got from them was about two weeks ago, which was my tracking information. Which, so it took about like two, two and a half weeks to get here, because I chose airmail. They give you several other options, or they only give Americans one other option, which is EMS. Which is a little bit more expensive, but if you want it quicker, EMS is obviously the better option. I wasn't on some sort of time constraint, so I just went with airmail because it was the cheaper option. So the petticoat itself was I believe like $42, $43, and with shipping it was like $56, I think, something like that. It wasn't that bad actually, it was really really cheap. But I totally recommend buying from Clova because very reliable, very fast, very friendly, and very prompt with their responses to messages. So now on to the classical puppets portion of this video. So let's open this up and see what's inside. It's in a sort of like shopping bag kind of thing, which is, if I can get this out, hold on. Which has a um, bubble wrap thing inside, which is all taped up and the petticoat's inside of it. So let's open this up now. So inside of the bubble wrap is another bag with the petticoat inside of it. <laughs> So this is the last bag, so I'm about to pull it out. Here it is. It smells kind of funky. Oh, it's inside out. Okay. Let's see, the tag is right here. Pop it. So let's turn this inside out. Or right side out, I suppose. So, here it is. Um, the lighting seems to be horrible. I might end up just filming back in the old spot because this doesn't look very good. But here it is. It's really short. Really cute though. I like that it's lined. So I believe it's made out of organza, if I remember correctly. It has this nice lace on it. And there's one, two, two layers of the organza and then a, um, a lining. Online it looks, I don't know if maybe I just need to fluff it up more or if it'll fluff up over time, but in the pictures it looks much more overwhelming than this. This is very underwhelming. Um, I'm gonna try it on under two different types of dresses and I'm going to try it by itself with a one petticoat underneath and with two petticoats underneath. I'm going to be trying it under Lucene Dream which is a soft chiffon dress and I'm gonna be trying it under my bodyline bustle skirt which is the heaviest piece that I currently own. I don't have any velvet yet. So I'm gonna try this under those and I'll film it for you guys so you can see what they look like. And we'll see how good this petticoat really is. So this is Lucien Dream by Angelic Pretty. It is a very soft chiffon dress and it very obviously requires a petticoat. It's very flat and very boring like most Lolita dresses are. And this one in particular actually requires a bell-shaped petticoat. So let's try the classical puppets one on. So this is with the classical puppets petticoat by itself, just the one petticoat. It gives it a pretty decent amount of poof. It looks very good. It gives it the shape that it needs, that nice bell shape or cupcake shape. And you could honestly probably just use the one petticoat by itself. This is with one of my leg avenue petticoats underneath the classical puppets petticoat. It gives it a significant amount of poof and it looks perfect honestly in my opinion. I think that two petticoats is the perfect amount of poof and the perfect shape. 
And I think three is too much, but you'll see that in a second anyway, because science. So this is with all three of my petticoats on, so two Leg Avenue and the Classical Puppets. It has a very, very full shape, very cupcakey or bell. And honestly, I think it's too much. I think there's way too much poof, but some people like that much poof. So honestly, if you want that much poof, definitely get two petticoats and the Classical Puppets one, because it looks really good. So this is my bodyline bustle skirt. This one kind of requires a bell shape, not so much as Lucene Dream. It's a very heavy skirt despite the thin fabric because of the layers and the many, many ruffles. This is the Classical Puppets Petticoat by itself under the bodyline bustle skirt. It gives it a little bit of shape, that cupcake shape, and it gives it a pretty decent amount of poof. But you might want a second petticoat for later on because eventually that poof will die, at least a little bit, and you might want a second one then. This is with one of my Leg Avenue petticoats underneath the Classical Puppets petticoat again. I think that this is the perfect amount of poof, it gives it the perfect shape, and it gives it a very, very good, very good poof. And I honestly think that two is perfectly fine. I don't think you need more than that. You might eventually, again, when petticoats deflate, because they all do. So you might need a third one after that. But straight out of the box, I think two is perfect. And my Leg Avenue ones are pretty worn out by now, so yeah. Two is completely perfect. So this is with all three petticoats on, and as you can tell, it gives it a lot of poof. Gives it that bell shape really well. But I think it's way too much because you can't tell in the video, but in real life the skirt was basically about to explode with how much poof there was. But as for the petticoat itself, I definitely, definitely recommend it. It's a really nice petticoat, it feels very comfortable when it's on, and it gives all your dresses the shape that it needs. So if you need that bell shape, I definitely recommend it. Thank you for watching, and please like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Hope to see you guys in the next one. And hope you check out my older videos because I have tons of those. So, see you guys later.